babes, so today I am back from vacation finally, so I'm gonna be throwing up some more videos, hopefully in the near future. I really miss being able to do my vlogs, um, but we are back in town now, so that was our last vacation of the year. And now I am going to video my face off. So um, today we're doing something a little bit different. Normally I do makeup videos, which I will continue to do because I love making those. Um, but I wanted to do a stitch fix unboxing for you because this is a new thing that I have sort of latched on to and signed up for. Um, so let me explain to you a little bit what it, about it a little bit so that you understand what it is exactly. So it is a subscription based um, business. So you pay only $20 a month and what you get is a personal stylist. You get uh, a box sent to you once a month with five items in it that they've styled just for you. They'll even go onto your Pinterest um, and look at what you've pinned to kind of get an idea. You do a survey and fill it out when you sign up to let them know what your style is. So for mine, I filled it out. I said I liked more relaxed, effortless feel, things that I could wear on the day to day and not feel like I'm trying super hard. So um, they, I feel like really did a great job of sending me pieces that are unique and pretty and still effortless. So it's not sloppy, I guess. Um, and this is my first box and with every box you get like an opportunity to provide feedback of I liked it or I didn't like it that wasn't quite what I was looking for or was it was great tell me more of that um, you can choose if you want accessories clothes just clothes you know whatever so it's a really cool service and I think the best part about it is that when you spend your twenty dollars that month for the subscription if you buy anything from the box that they send you the twenty dollars is deducted off the cost of that so you really don't lose anything if anything you need to at least pick one thing from the box that you like to apply your twenty dollars to otherwise you kind of just lose your twenty dollars for that month in paying for the service so um it's a super awesome thing oh another great thing that totally surprised me i didn't even notice this was in my first box um, and I think this is standard. I don't think it's just for the first box, but I'll have to double check and let you know in the comments below. But you get 25% off if you buy all five things. So um, they sent me three shirts and two dresses, and if I were to buy all of them with the discount and with the $20 that I've already sent deducted from it, my balance would only be $217. So you get a personal stylist, someone else picking things for you, which is a nice refresher, I think, because sometimes I get sick of what I pick out for myself and I gravitate towards the same things. So it's nice to try things that you wouldn't necessarily grab at first sight and someone else's opinion of what might look good on you so it's really awesome I love it totally worth 20 bucks a month I mean you spend more on than that on Starbucks in a month probably so um, anyway let's get into it I will show you what I received in my first box um, just to let you know it comes like this it has the little logo thing here so you know what it is it has the directions on the inside of the box and um, for your five items, it also send, they also send you this envelope. And inside the envelope is a notice that says, thanks for letting us style you. It breaks down all the prices for each item, where they're from, who, who made them, the designer, whatever. And uh, the total price if you wanted to buy all five items. They also send you... Um, more like more explicit directions in case you need a refresher which is helpful obviously and then this was like my favorite part because this really made me kind of attached to the items i guess that's not really a good thing since i probably don't want to get suckered into buying all five every time but um my stylist sent me like different pairings so for this dress here's what you can put with it for this dress here's what you can put with it here's how to dress it up dress it down super awesome so just to give you kind of a close-up yeah so I love that it's also a personal note from my stylist Lindsay I mean how fun is her job I want her job shoot I actually looked at their career section on their website and they don't need anybody in North Carolina so but anyway um, oh and then the last thing in the last thing in the box is of course the USPS return bag. So this is so awesome because your postage is already covered and all you have to do is throw the clothes back in the bag and throw it in the mail. So it's not even like you have to print off a return label or do all that bull shizaki. You just throw it in the envelope and mail it out. Really great. 
All right, now I'm gonna show you what they sent me. So the first thing that like totally caught my eye is this dress and my husband didn't think it was very flattering. I'll put up pictures on my blog so you can decide for yourself. I thought it was so cute, like totally uh, June Cleaver kind of-esque with some embroidered flowers. It's, so it's like chambray material with um, embroidered flowers. It's a close up for you. And I just think this is so pretty and feminine. You could put a cardigan with it, wear some flats or some fun strappy like tan brown sandals. And I think that's pretty easy to wear. It's really like not touchy material so you can just like fold it up and you know, if you, I mean, I'm gonna hang, hang it because I'm probably gonna keep this one, but it's just not like a delicate material where you're like, oh crap, it got wrinkled. You know, it's just something you can throw on and look cute in and not have to worry about it. So I love this. Good job, Lindsay. The second item is also a dress, and this I really, really love as well. Um, it sucks that I love everything and I want to buy it all, um, but this is just a black maxi dress, and it's like that somewhat stretchy, actually this is pretty stretchy, cotton material, and it just goes straight to the floor. Um, right here, kind of cuts in right under the bosom, and it has sort of like patterned I don't know if you can see that yeah like pattern material right here just as a nice added detail so really pretty and flattering and you could wear a nice actually I could wear this necklace with it let's see that bow perfection um if you've seen any of my blog or my fashion posts you know i'm more of like a pear-shaped individual <laughs> so um sometimes with maxi dresses i have to be careful about like how big my butt looks but since this is all black and because the sleeves kind of go out at the shoulders i feel like it really makes me look proportionate and helps actually hide the way that this is it hides some of the tummy and it doesn't really accentuate hips too much so um yeah, I mean, I'd love to lose five pounds before I wear this, but all in all, I'd have to say for a really like thin cotton material maxi dress, it's very flattering, even though I've got the badonkadonk. Okay, the next thing is this, uh, it's like chambray, but it's like a cot, more of like a t-shirt, like a thick t-shirt material. And this I think is so cute. I thought this was really flattering. It goes kind of up high on the neck and cuts down here. So it's a, sort of a sporty fit. But you could easily wear this with white jeans or blue jeans, um, a little cardigan or a jacket. It's super comfy. It's a little stretchy and it also is very flattering. Like it doesn't show any of my chub anywhere. So that's nice. There's a pocket here for some interest. And it's a tad bit longer in the back. So you never have that problem of it coming up above your jeans. Like I remember back in middle school, that would always happen to me and I was always paranoid that my butt crack was hanging out. That would not happen with this shirt. So good job to whoever figured out that. Do you guys like my mug? Got it at Home Goods last night. It's kind of like really pretty, I think. Second to last item is this sort of tunic um, cotton shirt. It's embroidered up at the top here with a cool design. And this is just so effortless and comfy. Um, it's got a little bit of detailing here and the material and more embroidery down at the bottom. And I just think, I just love this so much. At first when I looked at it, I was like, oh, whatever. But then like the more I thought about what I could pair with it, I was like, yes, I need that. So um, I will definitely be keeping this one. And the last item um, is probably the one that I was most on the fence about. But when I saw what in her little like lookbook that she sent me of what she paired with this I was like eek I want it so anyway <laughs> it's a sort of um it's a sort of loose fitting tunic again very easy to wear it's going to cover up any um parts of your st tummy that you want to cover it's got a cute pattern here and this crocheted bit at the top so very cute yay Lindsay Good job with my first stitch fix. Um, hopefully I'll become a more stylish individual because of this. All right, so that's it. That's all I have for you guys today. I hope that you enjoyed that. If you like unboxing videos, please comment down below or give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it because I am not opposed to getting more subscriptions to different things. So um, 
I can't wait to show you next month's box and stay tuned this week or next week ish I'm gonna be doing a pretty big giveaway with two other blogger friends of mine um, so stay tuned for that that'll be super fun and really some cool prizes uh, in that so I will see you in my next video bye guys